first think that things weren't quite okay? If I could be honest, I would say probably around about the time of our mother's funeral, about 12 years ago, I think. And she, Louise didn't cope with it very well. But then because no one in the family had died before, we didn't know really how any of us were going to cope with grief. Um, but it was really when our father had um, a couple of small strokes and she didn't come and look after him which was just so out of character because mm. she and daddy had always been very close but then eventually when daddy had a you know major stroke and he um heart attack and he was in hospital and they said well you know he probably won't last the night and i phoned her and my husband richard phoned her and, and she just said i can't come can't i won't come can't come i won't be able to find the hospital well it was a small hospital in a small town it wasn't going to be that difficult I didn't think. I said, you know, I sat her down afterwards and said, you know, what is going on? And she just burst into tears and said, I'm having trouble with my short term memory. Um, she said, you know, I do things like I park the car and I can't can't remember where I parked it. So I said, well, have you seen the doctor? Huh? No, she hadn't. So I said, well, come on, let's make an appointment and we'll sort of get the ball rolling. We've got to find out what it is. And I didn't for one moment think it would be dementia or, or Alzheimer's. Well, no, or I mean, how like old that. was she at that point? Uh, 56, 55. Well, wouldn't it wouldn't occur to you, would it? No, absolutely not.